They're the man and woman of every man and woman's dreams. So naturally, they make a perfect pair. I'm in love with your wife. Oh, wonderful. Me too. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 times Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds made us believe in love. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're taking a look at instances where Blake and Ryan were the ultimate power couple. Number 10. When Blake posted a Father's Day photo On December 16, 2014, Blake and Ryan welcomed their daughter James into the world. The following June, Ryan celebrated his first Father's Day as a proud papa. And is she talking? Um, yeah, she's saying mama. She like, yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you. You know what, though? You know what my wife doesn't realize, though? Is that she calls me mama, too. To commemorate the event, Blake took to Instagram and shared a photo of her hubby holding James in a baby carrier. We're not sure what's cuter, the pic itself or Blake's caption which reads, Since the day our baby was born, I felt so strongly in my heart that you were most likely the father. Equally funny and adorable, this post essentially sums up why you should be following both Blake and Ryan on social media. You're always bound to uncover a comedic gold mine. Number 9. When Ryan showed off his photoshopping skills I'm not really nervous right now. Before my performance, I'll be a little nervous. But Back in 2001, Britney Spears and Justin Timberlake sported matching denim ensembles at the AMAs. 14 years later, Ryan Reynolds photoshopped a picture of the former couple in infamous outfits, replacing their heads with Blake's and his own. Ryan posted the altered image on Twitter, writing, The night started exactly as planned, but I take full responsibility for the denim condom. It was a mistake. Aside from being a hysterical blast from the past, Ryan's tweet came out at just the right time. What with the denim on denim fashion trend making a comeback? I see you're still sticking with the denim. Number 8. When Blake's wedding dress got burnt any bride that's ever walked down the aisle knows how important a wedding dress is. So you can imagine how devastated Blake Lively was upon discovering a burn mark on her custom Marquesa gown. This incident occurred during a performance from Florence Welch at the wedding reception. Shortly after sparklers were broken out, Blake discovered a huge burn on her dress. Although Blake was initially heartbroken, her new husband helped her to see things from a different perspective. Ryan told his wife that the memory of Florence singing would be forever preserved through this blemish. Blake later told Vogue that the burn mark is now her favorite part of the dress. Isn't that beautiful? Number 7. When Blake talked about how Ryan makes her laugh. What's Blake Lively like? She's wonderful. No. What's Blake Lively like? You're a f***ing pig. Ryan Reynolds has demonstrated his comedic chops in movies like Van Wilder, The Proposal, and of course Deadpool. Fourth wall break inside a fourth wall break. That's like... 16 walls. So it shouldn't come as a surprise that he's just as hilarious off screen, at least according to his wife. During an interview with Sway Calloway, Blake Lively discussed Ryan's ability to put a smile on her face. Blake mentioned that her husband is constantly making her laugh, even during really inappropriate situations. For example, Blake hinted that Ryan could conjure chuckles anywhere, including funerals. Huh. Funerals, no, not a good place to laugh. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, he's just, he's just, he makes everything fun and enjoyable. I don't know, he's, he's, he's terrible. He says the most inappropriate things at all times. A sense of humor is one of the best qualities you can find in a spouse. It's clearly a staple of Blake and Ryan's marriage, both in sickness and in health. Love is blind, Wade. No, you're blind. Number six, when Ryan lovingly vowed to use Blake as a human shield. Yeah. And you, decent guy? No, 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 no. <laughs> terrible, terrible human being. <laughs> After the birth of their first child, Blake and Ryan's love for each other blossomed like never before. At the same time, Blake quickly went from being the most important person in Ryan's life to being numero dos. Speaking with David Letterman, Ryan explained that he would have taken a bullet for his wife early in their marriage. The instant their daughter was born, however, Ryan vowed to use Blake as a human shield to protect that baby. I would use my wife as a human shield to protect that baby. Whether he was being dead serious, just joking, or a little bit of both, Ryan's dedication as a parent couldn't be more evident. We're sure Blake would also go to extremes if it meant keeping James safe. My wife, that's, that's you know, she's breakfast, lunch, and dinner. She's a, a human Denny's. Number five, when Ryan helped Blake prepare for a role. In The Shallows, Lively played a surfer at the mercy of a great white shark. 
Given the subject matter, this proved to be one of the most daunting shoots of her career. In need of guidance, Blake turned to her husband, who's no stranger to thrillers, having starred in the Amityville Horror and Buried. In a People interview, Blake opened up about the advice Ryan gave her. He explained to her that this role wouldn't just be an acting challenge, but a physical feat. Thus, she had to prepare for the film as if it were an athletic event. This ultimately helped Blake pull off one of the most convincing performances of her career. I love you so much, and I miss you more than I ever, I ever even realized I could. Number 4. When Ryan Shared the Baby's Birth Story As mentioned before, Ryan never misses an opportunity to joke around, no matter what the occasion. This was especially apparent when his wife went into labor. As the parents-to-be waited in the delivery room, Ryan didn't hesitate to play Marvin Gaye's Let's Get It On. You decided to play a song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you play um, when your wife was I, in labor? I jammed a little uh, Marvin Gaye's Let's Get It On. <laughs> yeah. The song didn't exactly put Blake in the mood. As Ryan explained to Seth Meyers, she looked at him as if steak knives were shooting out of her eyes. It, it was like steak knives came out of her eyes. <laughs> she was like, are you <laughs> me right now? At the same time, Blake still found humor in the situation. Talking to Conan O'Brien, Ryan revealed that the doctor's cell phone went off during the delivery. In response, Blake told the doc to go ahead and take a personal call. Number 3. Whenever they look at each other Even when there's trouble in paradise, celebrity couples will habitually put on their happy faces in the presence of paparazzi. Based on Ryan and Blake's photos together, however, it's safe to say that their feelings are 100% genuine. Just look at the way they adoringly gaze into each other's eyes with those shimmering smiles. These two look like they belong on a poster for a Disney fairy tale. Speaking of which, are we the only ones who want to see Lively as Prince Aurora and Reynolds as Prince Philip? The point is, if you want to see true love incarnate, look no further than these two. Number 2. When Ryan Got a Star on the Walk of Fame In 2016, Reynolds earned a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. He attended the ceremony with Blake and their two children marking the foursome's public debut as a family. When the time came for Ryan to give a speech, he had a few heartfelt words for his wife, calling her the best thing that's ever happened to him. Well, the second best thing, right after the star. You are the best thing, the best thing that has ever happened to me. Second only to this star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. He proceeded to thank her for their incredible children making him the father of his dreams. You've made me the father of my dreams when I thought I only had fun uncle potential. Blake later expressed her affection for Ryan on Instagram, describing herself as beyond proud of his achievements. Could these two stars possibly shine any brighter? Before we get to our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Number 1. When a double date brought them together I'm going to make you look good up there, don't worry, okay? Now let's get these pants off and fly some planes. Most people know that Ryan Reynolds and Blake Lively first met while filming The Green Lantern, arguably the only good thing to come out of that movie. Although they became buddies during the shoot, it was a double date that truly marked the beginning of their romance. Interestingly enough though, Blake and Ryan weren't paired together at first. She was with another guy and he was with another girl. Nevertheless, the chemistry between Blake and Ryan was like fireworks, making them realize there might be something more to their relationship. We went on a double date with, she was on a date with another guy and I was on a date with another girl and, and that was the most awkward date for their respective part because we were just like fireworks <laughs> coming across the... While that's a darling story for sure, one can't help but wonder what became of their other dates. Talk about a real life when Harry met Sally encounter. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.